Folks, another satellite quick bite here on how to create a manifest and add subscriptions to that manifest uh, using the uh, Red Hat uh, uh, subscription portal. So I'm logged in now to my uh, customer portal at access.redhat.com. Um, and then from here, I'm going to go to my subscriptions allocation page. And if you need to get it, if you need to figure out where this is at, once you log in, you can always hit subscription to upper left. It'll take you to your subscriptions dashboard, and then from there you can also get to the subscriptions allocations page. <clears throat> and this is where we keep all the manifests that you can use for your satellite environment. And, and in my case, I've got three existing. And if I wanted to, I could click on these and edit these subscriptions, uh, edit these manifests rather. I could remove or add uh, any new subscriptions to that manifest. That way I could refresh it in my satellite. But in this case, I want to show you guys how to create a new subscription. Uh, new, new subscription manifest, rather, sorry. So from, from this page, we'll just, it's pretty simple. We'll click new subscription allocation. We'll give this a quick, uh, we'll give us a demo. We'll, we'll, we'll call it quick bots. And it's going to be a satellite 6.8 type. This is important. This needs to match whatever version your satellite is currently. Now, as you upgrade, um, the manifest will be upgraded as part of that. So just, just this is just for this initial, uh, initial creation. So it's a satellite 6.8 manifest. We'll hit create. <clears throat> and once this is created, it's going to drop us to a menu that will let us attach any uh, subscriptions from our portal. You can see here, it's been created. Right now, there are zero entitlements uh, on this manifest, so it, it's just essentially blank. From here, we can click on the subscriptions tab. And now, we can choose the subscription we want to allocate by clicking the Add Subscriptions button. And once we're in here, you will see a list of all the available subscriptions that is in your environment. Now, keep in mind, these are ones, these are subscriptions that are not currently consumed by a manifest. So these are applicable to be used on a new manifest or assigned to an existing one if you're modifying one that's already existing. So in my, in my example, I'm going to just add, let's just say I'm going to add 10 of the 60-day product trials for, for uh, Ansible Automation. I'm going to add, let's say I'm going to add two of these vert managers and then two of the, the vert manager for power just so I can show how this works. Again, in your, in your portal, you'll have all your man, uh, subscriptions that are available to be put onto a manifest. Hit the submit button. And then once this is finished, those subscriptions will be included into that particular manifest. And you'll be able to export that manifest to be brought into your satellite so that you can consume those in your satellite. Just as a quick example here, I can go to my, uh, it shows me my subscriptions, and now you see that those those numbers are assigned here. And then I can also go to the details section here. Um, and it shows that I've got my 14 entitlements. Remember, we did the, the 2, 2, and 10 for, for a total of 14 there. And I can always, um, when I'm ready to import this into my satellite, I can hit the export manifest button. And this will give me a download uh, of my new manifest. And this manifest I can bring in and bring into my satellite. Um, and then once it's in my satellite, I can I will now be able to see those new 14 entitlements that I just assigned to it. That's a really quick and easy way to create a new manifest and then add subscriptions on that manifest and then export it so that you can bring it into your satellite for management. Hope that's helpful.